everyone. I'm showing you this month's soccer girl box. Uh, uh, they're sharing the Tokyo Festival treats this month. Tokyo Matsuri. This is the seventh month. It's for September. Um, yeah, let's just get started. Their maker highlight this month is Amazaiku Yoshihara. Um, it's an Edo candy in modern Japan. They make really traditional sweets from the 1600s. Um, so th it looks like they included a couple of ginger cinnamon candy that they make in this box. And another maker's Kobayashi Sega. And they make fried beans. So there, there is the different flavors. Okay. okay here's one of the these guys. It's a spicy caviar flavor. Okay, the first product is um, the Hanabi jelly, the fireworks jelly. Um, it has apple flavoring in it, so it has a little, a little popping bubbles in it. And then um, the spring water Utagi jelly. I think I'll have it right now. Looks nice. This is their little dish they sent with. They're really nice. And I'm collecting all of them. They're the best. I like these purple. Okay. And here's the tea packets. Uh, it's, they sent two Secha tea packets this time. That looks like they sent a non pen. I don't know. Oh, it's right here. Here's the non pen. Um, it's just like sugar loaf bread, but it tastes, it kind of tastes like mine. And they sent a few banana flavored manju. They look nice. And banana. Yeah. yeah, so here's the picture of the ginger cinnamon candy from Amazaiku Yoshihara. So I guess little hard candies is an really fancy box. Well, it, it's only from Sakura Co. You can't really order from this store otherwise. So that's nice that it got sent. Um, so the pre picture this time, spotlight time, this time is Tok Tokyo. That's a picture of Sensoji Temple. It's located in Asakusa District. Here's a picture of the Sencha tea that I already showed you. Um, and this is a lacquer ware plate. It's they send different utensils each each time. Um, you also get two um, ginger okoshi. A classic sweet from the Edo period. It has a, it's a rice puff that has peanuts in it. Um, there's a sweet potato cinnamon cake. It's shaped like a sweet potato. But they fill it with filling. It, it looks really yummy. Um, and Castella bites. They're, they're shaped like festival in things like fish and octopus. Uh, 
I, I could get um, Takoyaki at a place near me in Boulder. Um, this is the Roko Manju. The Six Sides Manju. It's in the Meiji area. And it's just known for its cube shape. Um, they also set another bomb kitchen. I really like the bomb kitchen. This one's tiramisu flavored. It has some alcohol on it, but it's in a really fancy bag. I'm really glad that they said that. So we're gonna have these two things right now with some tea. There's the Kobayashi Seika beans again. They sent a caviar flavored one. And here's the Ukai Sunbei cracker. And more crackers. And PVP crackers. Here they are. So Amazaiku is the art of creating detailed sugar sculptures. So here's somebody working on a detailed sculpture. They're like really fancy candy pops. So Tokyo used to be called Edo, and they have three great festivals. So they have the Kanda Festival. It's held every other year to alternate with the Sano Festival. It's tied to the Kanda Myojin Shrine. It's supposed to promote wealth and the Sano Festival. It has 500 people in costumes. The parade takes nine hours and they go over to Hiei Shrine. And Tokugawa Hachiman Festival the water throwing festival. So all the firefighters and police officers throw water on the on the parade. People dressed as the court traditional court costumes. Then they have another photo contest you can um, win little soy sausages. Alright, everybody, thanks for watching. I'm gonna have these right now. Photo fries. Uh, here's the front of it again. The little postcard that was sent, uh, the postcard cards look like really nice watercolors.